on an island off mainland Singapore, spanning two hectares of land across two sites. This is Southeast Asia's largest battery energy storage system to date. We are now on Jurong Island where we have about 800 battery packs in total spread across two sites. The Sankop Energy Storage System is like a large scale battery which can store and discharge up to 285 megawatt hours of energy. The amount of stored energy is enough to power around 24,000 households in a single discharge and is an important part of Singapore's green goals as the nation looks to achieve net zero emissions by 2050. Singapore has raised our climate ambition. To achieve this, we will need to advance Singapore's energy transition and to deploy a lot more renewable energy. And with year-round sunshine, solar power is the most promising renewable energy source for Singapore. So with this, we aim to deploy at least two gigawatt peak of solar by 2030. The amount of solar energy generated will be enough to power around 350,000 households a year. But renewable energy has its downsides, and the biggest issue is intermittency. Power generated from solar panels is not constant. When there is a rain, when there is a clouds that covers the sun, the energy generated from solar dip. So intermittent nature of solar power can create imbalances in the energy system. As we scale up the use of solar, it is important to address this issue of solar intermittency. This is where ESS comes in as an important tool as large-scale batteries so that it helps to maintain grid reliability. The Energy Market Authority in June 2022 appointed Samcorp Industries to build, own and operate a 200 megawatt hour ESS. So there are very few projects that allow you to do good by both your organisation as well as Singapore. But this battery storage project was able to allow Singapore to use it in order to address supply security concerns within the power grid, increasing its resilience. SEMCORP was well positioned to do this. We have about 400 over megawatts worth of energy storage capacity in the UK and we'll be able to do that in Singapore as well. Leveraging their renewables capabilities and experience on Jurong Island, the team built the energy storage system at two sites, Banyan and Sakra. In June 2022, work began. But with the scale of the project, the team faced an uphill challenge. A project that you, of this scale, of usual timeline is about 18 months, we managed to complete within six months. Motivating the entire team to go in the same direction was a challenge. Many subcontractors didn't even believe the project schedule was realistic. With a time crunch and logistical delays from Typhoon Muifa, the team had to get creative. To complete Banyan and Sakra together concurrently with um, the manpower that we have here, there's a lot of moving parts that's running concurrently at the same time. From piling to heavy lifting and cable laying, the team had to coordinate various activities across the two sites in order to deliver the project on time and in a safe manner. After months of hard work, the project was successfully commissioned, clocking in over 235,000 safe man-hours. This is not about SEMCOP, this is about a collective group of people. If we work together, everything can be achieved. The project's success was made possible only with solid teamwork with our partners. When everyone works together, it really makes uh, all the small parts and the minor details come together and work well together. This has been an exciting learning journey for everyone. Our hope is that together with the Singapore government and with the customers based in Singapore, we're able to create solutions, sustainable solutions, to decarbonize the energy portfolio.